When issued with a life jacket, put your arms through the back straps and put the jacket on. Fasten the buckle. Tighten the belts at both sides and tuck the loose ends away. Never approach a helicopter from the rear. Do not proceed any further than the baggage compartment door and avoid the danger area at the front of the aircraft. Always approach and leave the helicopter from the side, under a right angle and within view of the pilot or crew member. Under no circumstance, depart or approach a helicopter during startup or shutdown. First, loosen the safety belt. Close the safety belt by sliding the small part of the buckle into the larger. Then, tighten the hip belt. The aircraft is equipped with safety and emergency equipment. The emergency exits in this aircraft are the escape windows in the sliding doors. There are two life rafts mounted at the right and the left side of the aircraft. The emergency locator transmitter, or ELT, is mounted next to the pilot at the right. The life rafts will generally be launched by the pilots. The life rafts can be launched manually by pulling the red grip on either side of the aircraft. At sea, enter the life raft, try to avoid entering the water and help your fellow passengers. If you can't reach the life raft, inflate your life jacket by pulling the red tags. The life jacket can also be inflated by mouth using the red tube. Excess pressure can be released by using the valve at the top. You'll be able to attract attention with the whistle. Removing the orange safety strip will automatically activate the light on the jacket when you enter the water. Dress code. Long trousers and closed shoes. Loose clothes are not recommended. Slippers, sandals, flip-flops and high heels are not allowed. Items longer than one metre should never be carried upright. Always carry them horizontally when you approach the helicopter. Never carry your luggage on your shoulder. Hand carry hats, glasses and caps to prevent them from being blown away by the main rotor wash. Don't step on the floating equipment when boarding. Use the step just above to board the aircraft. Papers aren't allowed in the cabin, but a small paperback is allowed. In the unlikely event of an emergency, please follow all instructions from the crew. After landing, please remain seated with your seatbelt fastened until the seatbelt light goes out and you're instructed to disembark. The pilot will give a thumbs up signal when the helicopter may be approached. Remember also that you may only approach the helicopter when the landing and anti-collision lights are off. Always follow the instructions of the pilot, HLO or HDA. They will guide you through the process of leaving the heli deck and on your return trip, the process of boarding the helicopter. Keep your life jacket on until you've left the heli deck and are in a safe environment. This flight is operated by Aerocontractors. Thank you for your attention and have a pleasant flight.